Okay, let me check my items real quick. Okay. It have plenty of repels. Okay. And start. Hello guys, it's Dinosaur64. Welcome back to more Let's Play Pokemon Dragon Ruby. In the last episode, we... I had to do ho the horrors of post-commentary. In this episode, I have a special guest with me. Hey, what's happening, guys? Yankee Gamer 5 here. Woo! I'll... I will... <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I'll send the link to his channel. He's an awesome... Really? We start this episode off with this? I don't get how they just swim in the middle of the ocean. Aren't they going to get tired after some swimming? I don't know. They probably have Pokemon. Like, this guy has a Pelipper. He can just fly. Yeah, he just hangs on to the Pelipper, though. Wouldn't just the Pelipper give out over time? And <laughs> just doesn't seem like a good idea. Yeah. Hmm. And again, we have to fly across, like, Route and City off our Pelipper. So I highly like that. So, yeah. Well, then again, can't you fly on, like, a Pidgeon? Like, I've seen, like, pictures of that. <laughs> yeah, I fly a, on I remember, Pidgey! I think there's a video of um, someone trying to fly on a Cypher and he couldn't, and he could fly like on a Pidgey. Yeah. I think there's like a, yeah, there's definitely a video of that, I remember. I don't know yeah. the exact name of it. I remember seeing something, yeah, I saw that too. It was like Gary and, I don't know, Ash. Gary. Gear Bear. Yeah. It's a purple shirt. Blech. Anyways, I'm gonna try to avoid all the trainers, and we're gonna head off to, wait a minute, I don't think. I'm supposed to go that way. Uh, to Evergrand City. That's, or Ever is that what it's called? Uh, Evergrand City? I don't know. I believe it is. Hmm. Or Evergrande, if you're playing the Mexican version or Spanish version. Of this game? I, I don't know, I guess. <laughs> um, how... Wait, I need to check the map here for a second. Is I don't know. Is On the topic of Victory Road, I really don't like this game's Victory Road. It's probably the most confusing. Yeah, very confusing. I and just need to get check to the it, map. Yeah. Ah, here we are. Map. Yeah. Okay. I just hate the whole dive system that this generation introduced. I don't think Victory Road has a dive system in that. Well, I'm saying to get to it, you have to do a dive over here, right? No, I, no, just... no, I don't think so. I think you do. Do you have to dive underwater and like make it your way there? I'm not sure. No, that's for like finding like Team Magma. Oh, no, wait, not Team Magma, okay. Team Aqua. Sorry. The same thing. They don't matter. Well, we're about to find out if we can dive or not. Um, wait, am I supposed to go down? Uh, it's down toward the bottom right of the map. And it's like, I remember, yeah, I think you have to do dive. Let's see. It's like a long stretch of uh, diveable water, and you go down, and you go down, and then right. I'm pretty sure then you have to use waterfall. Oh, no, wait, I'm heading the right way, I think. Hey, you have to just keep going this way. Well, just make sure your Pokemon has uh, dive and waterfall. That's why I bought Whale Lord. Oh, there you go. Well, I don't think we're gonna need dive, but we do need Waterfall and Rock Smash. So. And I already have some Pokemon with oh, strength. Hey, okay, you don't need dive. There you oh, go. For some reason, I always thought you need dive. I don't know. I probably got that confused. Like, I, yeah, we're gonna said, take but... a giant whale up the waterfall. Well, it actually I... makes sense. It's a big Pokemon. It's the biggest Pokemon. Yeah, but like the water. Yeah, but is it bigger than the waterfall itself? Like, I mean, Whalor's a bit, like, Maybe. tall, but, like, is he, like, big enough to, like, jump over a waterfall? <laughs> I can just imagine him, like, going up the waterfall like a salmon, and you're just, like, on his back. <laughs> <laughs> hey, come on, Whalor, you can do it! <laughs> Two Evergrand! Two Evergrand! No, I think there's a script, no, that's Emerald, okay. Uh... Well, what, this Victory Road's different, or... Uh, in, at the beginning, you fight a, a Wally, but at the oh, end yeah, of this yeah. game, you, yeah. Mm. Wally. First, first trainer. This seemingly infinite of harsh row lives up to its name of Victory. Or yeah, Failure. <laughs> Real original, they kept just naming it Victory Row in every single game. Rosalia. You think they would change the name over to different territories. Hmm. Victory, maybe, is there any, like, foreign words for victory? Like, yeah, probably in Japanese, I wouldn't know, because I don't know Japanese, but... How about Death Road? I don't think people would travel on that. <laughs> <laughs> victory sounds, like, cheery and optimistic. Death Road would kind of... Just die. <laughs> no, I, would, I would go around Death Road and try to find Happy Road. Hmm. Yeah, Flash is definitely... Plus here. 
It's stupid that Flash doesn't illuminate the whole screen, though. I don't know. That's kind of dumb. Yeah, but it doesn't, like... Well, you can still, like, see. I know logistically if you had, like, a lantern, it wouldn't light up the whole cavern, but still. I, Let's I don't see. Know. Is there anything over here? I want to say there's an item over here, but I really can't remember. I think this is the way to get This somewhere. is the way to the Elite Four. I don't know. But this video has proven that I really don't remember Victory Road in this game. Didn't you so do a let's? Didn't you favorite. do a let's play of this game? Or not? Not Dragon yeah, Movie. Yeah, I, I did a let's play of Emerald, but that was like two years ago. I've forgotten everything. I remember I saw like a video of it like a long time ago, and you had like a Mighty Anna and a Cactern, I think. Yeah, my team was um. I had uh started with a Torchic, so I had a Combuskin. I had a Mighty Anna. I had a uh, the Cactus Dude, like you said, Cactern. Yeah. Uh, I had. Uh, I have. See, I, I did it so long, I forgot my yeah, team. Yeah, like, I can't remember, because i only seen, like, one video. I want to say you had Alakazam for some reason. No, no, I didn't have Alakazam. I, I'm trying to think. Wow, I really don't remember my team. Let me actually look that up fast. <laughs> so I have access to things. I'm not actually recording Keep a video up. right now. I love the freedom I have by being a guest. Yeah, let's see. I am... Yeah, th I agree with you on one thing. This victory road is definitely confusing. I is like I remember one game. The victory road is just basically a straight line, and then you're in. It's awesome. I think it's actually in crystal, or like gold, silver crystal. Mm. I'm not positive. I know one game. It's just like straightforward, mm. which is awesome. I want to say that is um, Sino, but uh, fourth gen, but. I don't really think so. Maybe, Wait, I don't know. Just Victory Road in general is like, oh, we gave you all these eight HMs, now you have to use them. I can't tell if it was Laron or Lantern. It's just annoying. Laron? Yeah, Laron. It's like, it, I don't, it tests you, but it's not really a test, I don't know. Hmm. It's annoyance. Yeah, a game said to be grind. annoying it's good sometimes. To grind. It's definitely good to grind, because you can find actually some useful Pokemon here. I guess. Isn't there like, um, I know there's a lot of Larons, maybe Akron's. Um, there's uh, also, uh, usually rock and ground Pokemon. Oriyamas. Vic mm. Fifth Gen's Victory Road had one awesome Pokemon. It's that, um, it's, uh, what's it? Urs Ursarang? I said, the no. Bear thing? I don't know. Uh, it was, uh, Black Solrock? and White. Black and White. Uh -oh. It Black had, I've... what was it? Dino. Yeah, the little thing that evolved into Hydreigon. Uh, I, I really don't know black and white, so I don't know. All I know is that there's an ice cream Pokemon. What? <laughs> yeah, that's the first thing I think about when black and white. Hmm, ice cream Pokemon. Made me hungry. Oh, he, okay. Here's my team, by the way. Okay. Okay. I had a Combuskin. Uh -huh. Not Combuskin. I had what's the final form? Blaziken. I had Akron, that Steel dude. Mm -hmm. I had Mightyena. Diana. I had a Whiskash. Whiskash. That was my, like, experiment Pokemon. I never used one, and eh, it was alright. Had a lot of HP. Uh, Cacturn, mm -hmm. and uh, Gardevoir. Wait, isn't that five? That's six. Uh, Cacturn, the Steel one, Agron. Blaziken, Mightyena, Whiskash, and uh, Gardevoir. Gardevoir. Oh, you didn't have a flying type? I thought you did for some reason. Um, I've done, like, three or four Pokemon Let's Plays, so... Probably one of those, maybe. Okay. I don't know, I usually don't pick a flying type, I don't know. No, no, wait, that just leads over here. I just use them mainly for slaves, not slaves, but I just use them time to time. Wait, did I, didn't I go up here already? I can't remember. Uh, I'm not, I just went back to the video. <laughs> Let's see. I'm, I'm a bad co pilot Flower star, nice. Oh, that's good. Well, you definitely have enough money, right? Because the game yeah. just gives you so much money toward the end. I saw you had like 30 repels, so... Yeah, I have enough money. Let me check actually how much... Not, not, not save. <laughs> Dang, that's yeah. a lot. Yeah, and you just blow it all on full restores if you even want. So you probably get like 50 of them. Do I go down? I don't know, because as the game series went on, they made it really less and less challenging when you get to the Elite Four. They'd really baby you. The first game was actually a challenge. Hmm. Because, yeah, mostly because it's the first game. Yeah. Back in the 
for back no days. Fight. Back when rap would kill you constantly and legendaries were hard to catch. Alright, speaking of rap, I remember when I would always get up to Lance, his Dragonair would always beat me because it would always do that rap thing and it would attack every turn because it was faster than me, so I would always lose to Lance because of that. I would always arm my Pokemon with Thunder Wave. True, that probably would have worked, but I wasn't smart. I was only eight back then, I don't know. How old was I? I think I was six when the game came out. Why are you asking me then. how old you were back then? Hey, you could have guessed, you know. You could have sounded smart and be like, oh, obviously he was six. And I'll be like, oh my god, you're a wizard. You're a wizard, Harry. <laughs> you're a wizard, Harry. I'm a what? Uh, oh, Hagrid. Hagrid. Oh, safeguard. Come on, that, sir. That's mildly sir, useless. Sir, sir. Yes. Here we go. I don't know how he's harnessing the power of water inside of a cave, but we'll go with it. Well, then again, there is a water section that really is the main annoyance of this. I think I think we're on it, actually. I think. If we are, then that makes things... Yeah. Yeah, right here. <laughs> Speaking of. Okay, that actually makes sense, then. Like, I summon the power of water. It looks like you go through those two rocks. Well, apparently he's Aquaman. Aquabird. Aquabird. Oh, yeah, I remember something from somewhere. You see this guy right here? Yeah, that's the um, the Wind Straits. Bra yeah, dude. that's the Wind Straits, son. Vito. I think his name's Vito. If it is, I'm I really... I trained together uh, with my whole family, down. every one of us. I'm not losing to anyone. Alright, if I got this right, then at least I remember this game. Let's see. Cool yeah! Cool Drader Vito would like to battle. Got a rap. I don't know, they really hyped him up, and it was just disappointing. I thought he was gonna be like an actual, like, Elite Four guy. Hmm. Or a gym leader, at least, but they just made him just a random dude in Victory Road. It was kinda, I don't know. That would, actually, I, I like that idea, actually. Like, have, like, a family member be, like, a gym leader. Although, don't we already have that in this game? Like, your father is the gym leader. Yeah, so I'm surprised they wouldn't, like, go off that again and, I don't know, they just obviously went in a different direction. I don't know why I said Magistrate. What does Magistrate mean? Is that just the name, or...? That is a Phoenix Wright reference. There was a case... Uh -huh. There was a case in... There was case three, uh, it involved a TV show, and the villain in that show was named Magistrate. Oh, okay. It didn't look, it didn't look anything like um, Guard War, but I just called him that because her, her and him that because I don't know. Mm. Wow, so I kicked it a lot. Yeah. You see, that's the one thing I like about Guard of War aside from Alakazam, because Guard of War is bulky and Alakazam is go die. <laughs> yeah. And Alakazam you have to trade, and it's just. Manetric, uh, Rampage for that. I don't know why, I always name Pokemon that look like Nido King-ish Rampage. Mm, I don't know, I remember I named one Elvis once. Elvis? Because <laughs> he's the king. Ah, oh, that makes <laughs> sense. I should have made him, I should have named him something that went well with, like, his pun of name, like the king or something. Mm. John King, I don't know. <laughs> Just name him John. Shiftry, Sludge Bomb. Uh, Shiftry is a cool Pokemon, but it's just not. Yeah. You know, I saw someone pull off a yeah. sweep with it. He was so proud. Yeah. In fact, it, probably he's still ranting about it actually. That's. Oh, uh, one of my favorite Pokemon was always like Zangoose. It was such a cool design, but it didn't evolve, so it was kind of. Eh. Zangoose. Oh yeah. Yeah, they won't X on him. Yeah, I remember. Uh, let's see. I will use this Carbos at you for his speed. Uh, da, 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 da. I'll give it to Rampage. I don't know why, but okay. Keep you up. I'll give it. To... Yeah, that, that should work fine. Because mm -hmm. mm -hmm. I want, because I want this full heal. Dang it. You will have the full heal. Speak you will you full. There you go. You know, it contradicts something. I was wondering, like, how could, like... The, like, I know, like, it's a water type, yes. But, like, 
Couldn't, wouldn't it be easier just to fly over the water than just swimming under it? Over it? Uh, one would assume that, but I... I don't know. It's, they wanted to get as many types in as possible. Yeah. Like, we have to get water something. Yeah. Sir. Yeah. That's what the kids love to do nowadays. I want to say there's a water type that can't learn surf for some reason, but I can't think of Magic any. Magic Carp. Magic Carp. Oh, yeah, that's true, yeah. And Feebass. There you go. We Somehow we got through Victory Road pretty Oh, wow, easily. we're actually at the exit, right? Yeah. That was fast. I didn't get that item over there, but I think it's just like a max elixir nah, or something. It's probably Earthquake. Who cares? Oh, Cactor, nice. Hey, it's Cactern your Cactor. What's he doing too. here? What's your Cactor doing here? Buddy. I his name's not Pokey, he's not mine. Imposter! Pokey! He has to move faster. Move faster, Pokey! <laughs> My oh wow, he made all his way with one Pokemon? Jeez. Well, I switched a couple times. Oh yeah, uh... No, I'm saying he did. Well, he it's Cacturn. Cacturn's a pretty good Pokemon. Mm. Uh, I'll heal up Rupier. I'll yeah, use... I'll use Wally's my super, really not that tough, so. I will use my super potions, not only to heal, but to waste them, because I want to get rid of them, honestly. Yeah, might as well use them all. And I'm going to save, just in case I lose, because I really don't risk uh, losing and not saving. Yeah, it's always good to save your progress. You don't want to play a game, then it crashes, then you have to do it all over again. Hi, Scotty. I bet you're surprised to see me here. I made it all the way here, and it's all thanks to you. Sky, losing to you that time made me stronger. But I'm not going to lose anymore. And we'll just see about that. Uh, Wally, you're probably the weakest rival in any of but the Pokemon honestly, games. <laughs> honestly, I think Wally makes a perfect rival, because at least he has the decency to fight you in Victory Road, unlike a certain other rival. If you know what I mean. Ah, uh, yes. Well, sh oh, are you talking about the girl? May. Yeah. You yeah, she's not. I don't know. She's not a rival. I don't, I don't like her. She, you can only fight her three times. And the last time you fight her, she doesn't even have a team of six. And her star is not fully evolved. Uh, I just don't see her as a rival because she's more interested in... Like, she's not even a real Pokemon trainer. I don't know. In the anime, they made her out to be, like, a contest person. In this game, she's like, oh, you want a battle? Okay. Yeah. Huh. She's like, hey, yeah. you want a battle? I have the time, but... At the time, could you battle? And she doesn't even give you the option to battle or not. Mm. That's the one thing with trainers is like, like why would you like, uh, like, like why do they say, hey, do you want to battle? And they just force you to battle. It's like, what the heck? I want a choice. Yeah. I don't know. Getting back on the rivals, I don't know. At least a lot of people hate Barry, but at least he was like actually like. Yeah, he, he was actually to do tough. Stuff. Yeah. Unlike me. I like Barry's good, Silver's good, obviously Gary's good, and uh, what were their names? Charon and the girl Sharon Bianca. And Bianca. Bianca. Uh, I haven't played that game that much, but they seem all right. Yeah. I like how they give you two rivals, so you have a type advantage against one. Yeah. I like how, like, when you choose your starter, it's debate of what your rival uses on his team. Hmm. Wait, I, that Magneton didn't have Levitate? Magneton doesn't have Levitate. Le it, levitate it can't normal. become an ability. I thought, I don't know, for some reason I thought that Everyone thinks that, honestly. Because be hmm. it is levitating. Yeah. I don't know, go on, what were you saying? I'm sorry. Uh, Magneton looks like it has Levitate, but it really doesn't. Hmm. I honestly thought it did, but it doesn't. His starter Pokemon, I was going to say, <laughs> taken down in one shot. <laughs> really? Come on, Wally. Double team? Really? Psychic would have probably taken uh, probably done a lot of damage, but... but Neo King's pretty strong. I mean, it's mm -hmm. faster than Gardevoir. Delcaddy. Oh. Ooh, this... Yeah, um... You know, I'm going to use Sludge Bomb because I don't want to risk Cute Charm. Good, good damage. I think Rampage was the most useful member throughout this entire Let's Play. 
New King's always a solid Pokemon. Yeah, no matter what game you play, they always it's like they always give you Nidorans and Nidoran uh, males and females in the beginning. So I got I got uh like I got rampaged like after I beat the first gym ish. Mhm. Mm and like I had the option to fight the uh, second gym, but I actually went off ahead and see what other Pokemon I could find, and I found Eevee and Nidoran. And Roselia, I will switch for that, actually, because, I don't know why, but, uh, I just want to, like, burn it to a crisp. Mm. Which Pokemon do you have in the box again? Uh, Jolteon. Ah, yes. Oh, by the way, speaking of the Eevee evolutions, I am thinking about doing a Let's Play of Pokemon XD. Hmm. Whoa! Ugh. <laughs> <laughs> You heard that, that don't was... Don't need to break things over it. Yeah. <laughs> I know it's an exciting I'm gonna game. do a Let's Play of Pokemon XG, raw. <sighs> Flip the table. <laughs> I didn't mean it. Amazing you heard that. Mm -hmm. uh, it was I actually my memory it. card falling down. My brand new one that I got. But it's fine, it's intact. So there's no need to worry. As Don would say. Pell's effect wore off. That's, that was perfect timing. It was. Okay then, we are here, and I am going to, actually, before I do anything, I'm going to withdraw Blitz and deposit Wayward. And you can actually fly back to this location? I believe so, yeah. You don't have to so, go yeah. back through Victory Road, right? Because I think it's usually a staple in this. Yeah. Let's, so. but though, just to be on the safe side, I'll see if you can. Right. Let's see. I'm pretty sure you can, because... In the later games, they probably figured that out. So I think it has like two sections, yeah. There's like Evergrande City Pokemon. Teleport, fly me to an area I'm already <laughs> at. If you go down more, I think it sends you to the other area, so yeah. Right. Okay then, now that we're here, I will let me see my items real quick. Uh, if I was that Pokemon Pokemar person, I would just charge everything at full price, like, and more. There's nowhere else to buy stuff. Okay. It's Monopoly. Okay, this is perfect. Okay, now I'm going to buy some items since I have so much money, I can't do it. I will mm. buy, um, how many hyper potions did I use actually? Let me check. I think, I think I have like 30 something. 34. 34. Hmm. Ah, uh, okay. I would, buy mo I would buy full of swords. You only have two of those. Okay, two. Let's see. Um, that means I would need. Yeah, this would be fine. 18, so I got ni a nice even 20. I think I had one full heal. <laughs> 99. All the full heals. Give me all your full heals. And seeing as how it's the Elite Four, and I don't know the difficulty, I'm going to buy 30 of these. Mm -hmm. So I have 50. Actually, you know what? Screw that. I'm going to buy 50. Oh, no, I don't have enough. Um, Wow. It's actually kind of surprising. Uh, who should I buy now? <laughs> buy one of everything. I'm gonna sell some crap. Stardust. I... Stardust. Nuggets. I say, some... if you're wondering why I kept them, is to save them for this. Uh, I know, big I pearl. Gonna run out. <laughs> There's so much money. Star piece. Heart scale. I may want that. Uh. Actually, I no wait. I can't move that while well on that screen. I will move this to the top so that way I have, can use it. Mm -hmm. There we go. And you can't you can't buy things that raise your PP, right? Uh, actually, I think you can, but it's just in a different store. It's oh. like that big. You know how like every Pokemon game has that like generic like big like supermarket kind of store. Yeah, that's in Lily Cove. Yeah. In this game? Yeah. Yeah, like, I think every single Pokemon game has one of those, and they're in every single, like, one of those. I'm going mm. to... I'm going to switch the Pokemon in the order I caught them in. I, That's I, cool. I think I caught... Well, if the first guy is a... Ice? Is... I don't know, wait. Uh, that's, it's that's dark, the first. That's dark, the second game. Dark. Should I take on the Elite okay. Four, or should I wait? I've been, um... I've been recording for 24 minutes. I would wait. You okay? Hmm. 
I would do it in the next part. Cliffhanger. Cliffhanger. Actually, I want to train anyway. Uh, actually, I'm. Hmm. I want to get the magnet. I want to get an item for Blitz. Mm -hmm. And a twisted spoon. Um, and you can get twisted spoons by wild abras if you use thief. And hmm. magnet, you need to do the trick room. Um, ah. But I don't want to do that stuff off screen though. That's the thing. Is there anything I can give him? Or place? Um. Why don't you do it off screen, but then show when you're about to get it, and then put that in the beginning of the next part? All right, I guess that makes sense. <laughs> I'm gonna give you a TM now. Actually, wait, the berries? Don't berries like berries? Berry. Uh, heals. Pro if I had a one berry, I'd give that to Guard of War, cause like synchronized. Like I used the one berry. Like, mm -hmm. you're like, oh, you toxic me, but Synchronize passes the toxic on to you, but I heal my toxic off. Mm. Can you actually do that, something like that? Would, it, would the Lumberry heal it first, and then... What, what does the Lumberry do? I'm sorry. Lumberry heals all status. And you're saying to do what? To... Okay, what? like, your opponent uses toxic, and you're holding yes. a Lumberry, right? Yes. And, like, Synchronize makes it so that your opponent also has the same effect as you, except for Confusion and Attract. Oh, yeah, that would probably work. Yeah, but the thing is, would the Lumberry activate first, or would the Synchronize? Okay, you know, no, I've been talking enough. I'm going to train my Pokemon up to level 50, um, because I honestly thought that it was going to be a lot more difficult than this, but apparently not. Mm-hmm, that's Actually, what he's going to do, folks. Did I heal? Yeah, I did. Okay, did. next time on Let's Play Pokemon Dragon Ruby, we will take on the Elite Four, and I will do all the Trick Room stuff off-screen, but I will show all the things you get. And I will show possibly me getting a a uh, Twisted Metal. All right. See you guys yep. then. I've been the Dinosaur 64. And I'm Yankee Gamer 5. See you guys next time. Bye. Later.